so old, but it's probably not. All right, Maroon 5, love them. We are at Costco right now. Also love Costco. Who doesn't? We're going to jump in the store and see if we could find any new things. They always have something new. So let's hop inside. If it's long, it'll be just a shop with me video. If it's not, you'll see the haul at the end. Let's go. Okay, so I've already looked around the store a little bit and saw amazing Christmas deals, but I wanted to show you this. Obviously, Christmas gift ideas, $99. I think they're coming out with a new Keurig. Am I wrong? I don't know. This one's on sale for 100 this week. A lot of air purifiers, that one's 100 Water pick removal for 60 Head to toe trimmer, 35 But this guy, it, was, it blows out heat well, and cool air, and it purifies. Three in one for $300. $100 for each uh, uh, task. I don't know. Sewing machine? Haven't seen one of these here for 140 a plate set, some dishes. These are finally on sale, the little wine glasses for $16. This thing's pretty cool, a wall outlet, but it allows you to charge um, phones, like the USB outlet, two for each outlet, and that's um, $16. Nope, nope, that's $15. Hey, what's up here? Oh my gosh, cutest thing, cutest little bear. That's $56.99. Christmas Village. Guys, I am swooning over all the Christmas decor already. This guy is $85. If you ask me, it's worth every penny. Early Christmas shopping. Hatchimals. Yes, yes. 37 bucks for all of them. Little VTech watch. Oh, a perfume set. I haven't seen this before. Airbuds or AirPods, whatever they're called. Those guys are pretty steep. $140. Let's not talk about that. Let's talk about these. I love this. If you have girlfriends, well, if you have that many girlfriends, I certainly don't. 10, <laughs> not here. Uh, but you can like divide them up and give gifts and I don't know, make a set. Oh, here's my kind of gift. Mm. These are on sale today, $8.59. Yes. Oh man, I'm gonna have to resist hard on these guys. But I don't know if I can. Okay, okay, wait, just keep walking, right? You guys will be my strength, just keep walking. And then some wine if you're into that. 30 bucks for four bottles. All right, so I've been needing a new Christmas tree. I want a skinny one because our house isn't that large. Look at this guy. This must be like 15 feet. How tall is this for real? What does it say, 12 feet? Holy shice. This thing is huge. It's pretty awesome. Oh my gosh. Guess how much? Guess that price, guys. Six hundred dollars. My house isn't even that tall. <laughs> the tallest part of my roof is not even 12 feet, I'm sure. Uh, well, I don't even know what these are. Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree skirts. That's a decent price. 30 bucks for those, if you like those. Um, I don't know what this is. Is this like an outdoor decor? 80 bucks for this. I don't know. It's pretty cute. I hear music. I think it's coming from this guy. Okay, first of all, those are pretty cute. And this Nutcracker fella. How much is he, $300? I'd rather buy the air purifier, no? Have that out all year round? <laughs> uh, this Angel, she's gorgeous. $90, oh, I'm skipping over. Candy canes over here. Okay, I feel like this is a deal. Set of six candy canes for $27. They come in two colors. Uh, some tablescape. Ooh, pre-lit Gartland. Oh, that could be really pricey. That's only $33. Ooh, wreaths. Oh my gosh. Okay, we passed these guys. They're gorgeous, but I feel like they would break in my yard. Those are $140, but these. Oh, can we talk about how gorgeous these are? These are $150. I want them. Ah, uh, please. You're welcome to my house. You're welcome to come. I'll leave carrots out. Oh, here's Santa Claus for $60. He's pretty cute. What do you guys think? I wonder if he moves. Ooh, he looks like he moves. How you doing? I don't know if he does, though. Hi there. Okay, someone just tried to get me to buy cable. <laughs> um, but these wreaths, I bought so many of these when I got married. Oh. That's a great price, $30. I feel like I spent $60 on each of them. I bought like seven. Oh, this one, if you're, if 
you're into an LED wreath, that guy is $50. Ooh, and an outdoor, this little tree is um, 62. Okay, this little lantern guy, that's really pretty, that decorative. Okay, this is turning into like a Christmas at Costco. Um, these presents are, how much are those? $62.99. I can't help it, guys. They have Christmas everywhere. Nativity scene. How much is that nativity scene? Polar Express. Oh my, it's not even November. It's not even October 15th. Oh, laser lights. Yes. Oh my gosh, how much is this? $44.99. I love the laser lights. They crack me up, dude. Okay, you guys need to tell me, what's a good deal? These lights, 33 feet, 32 and a half feet, um, $11. I'm in the market for new Christmas lights. I kind of like this deal with the all white business going on, um, but I don't know what a good price is. This is 33 feet, 100 lights for $11. I feel like I should buy like six, maybe more sets of these. I don't know. Can I get a better price elsewhere? You guys let me know. They also have icicles. A little, little steep in that price. Ooh, little spheres. Those are $23. How many spheres do you get? Just three? No way you get only three for $33. No, you, okay, you get 50. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, that would never come in my cart. $11 for a Luminex? Oh, you throw it over your bushes. Ooh, I feel like I need this too. Oh, my house is gonna get a huge facelift this year for Christmas. Well, at least in my mind it will. I'm not sure how my pocketbook is gonna feel about that or my husband. <laughs> okay, these glitter gem garlands, $38. These are really pretty though. I feel like I need a fireplace for Christmas time. Anyone else? Every other day of the year, I'm like, nope, I'm pretty much already on fire. It's so hot here in Florida. These micro lights, oh my gosh. I also feel like I need these, even though I know I don't. How much are they? 13 or 25? Oh, and then these. Okay, seriously, do they only have Christmas stuff out? What is that, pillows over there? Ooh, stamps, forever stamps, some candles. What is this? A wax painted something for $15. Okay, this is legitimately turning into a everything Christmas, but I don't even care. I shared with you guys the wrapping paper earlier. This is a new kind of wrapping paper. I shared with you that one, which I'll show you in just a minute, but this is a set of four. So you have four different options, $12. How many, how many like square feet do you get in here? Let's look. Oh, 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 here we go. I'll show you the prints in case you're curious and uh, that is the amount of square feet you get 180 in each roll pretty amazing and then over here this is like the high quality crazy wrapping paper that will literally last you five years if you wrap 100 gifts each year look how thick it is how much is this guy that is 13 okay 19 dollars for 30 handcrafted christmas cards can you imagine though, someone spent how much time handcraft, literally with their bare hands crafting those cards and you're only spending $20. You know what I mean? It takes me an hour to make one <laughs> like handcrafted card. 40 holiday cards for $16, well, $15.50. Ooh, these are really pretty down here. Um, a ton of ribbon. That little snowman, is that a snowman? Yeah, he's cute. You want to take a note. Some command strips for $14. Ooh, ooh. Oh my gosh, they're finally on sale. I've been waiting since like back to school time. They are on sale for $7.89. But will I get them even though they're on sale? Oh man, I have this debate with myself every time. I see something and I'm like, mm, I'll wait till it's on sale. And then when it goes on sale, I'm like, nah, do I need it? I don't know. They also have some LED lights over here. Oh my gosh, something just turned on. I don't know what that is, motion sensor or something. This chandelier is gorgeous. We took the chandelier out of my dining room because we were always like sweating at dinner time. So we put a fan in there. I feel like it would be so much prettier with a chandelier, but you know, comfort, 
over uh, classiness. Okay, I'm sorry. These are the prettiest gift tags I have ever seen. Look, they even have Olaf. So stinking cute. Guess how much they are, guys. Guess that price. Guess that price with the little reindeer and Mickey Mouse. Oh my gosh. All right, how much are they? Were you right? They were are eleven dollars, and the tape on sale for six. How many rolls do you get? Six rolls, six dollars. Can't beat that price, and it's the good quality tape. All right, they have a bunch of shoes here. These look like all men's shoes. I wonder if they have like a women shoes section. But ever since, I think it was last year when they had the Toms for like twenty-five bucks, and I tried so hard to find a good size to fit me, but I couldn't. But now I just regret it. I think maybe if I would have bought them they would have just stretched out over time. Oh, here's some boots. I saw these last time. Oh, they're so pretty. I, f I feel like I should buy these. I would regret not getting those as well because they're only like 25 bucks. Are they on sale? No, that says men's. How much are these? Uh-oh, I might be in trouble. Okay, I couldn't find a price on the shoes, but someone told me Payless has really good quality boots. Anyway, onto this vacuum. I'm pretty sure this is the vacuum that I have. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, I thought it said cordless, but it says corded. Ultra. I have a Shark Rocket, but this is Deluxe Pro. And it's got some kind of light situation happening <laughs> if you need that. Um, but it's on sale right now. 119, normally 150. So that's a great price. Also have a vanity mirror there if you're in the market. Oh, wait, wait, wait. A Dyson? Oh, this is cord free. What's up? What's up? Cord free? I think I need that in my life. Who likes unplugging and plugging in vacuum cords? No one. I believe that would be no one ever. <laughs> Those are the prices. Ooh, $239. That's an even better deal. But that one has a cord, so is it worth it? They have a whole stinking aisle of just vacuums. Oh, robot. Anyone have a robot vacuum? Let me know how much you loved it or hated it. I hated mine, uh, so we returned it. But seriously, for almost the same price as the Dyson, you don't have to do the work. <laughs> Seems like a good deal. Uh-oh, this one looks, uh, oh, I thought it was broken. Is it? I don't know, or just see-through. <laughs> okay, hold on. I think a couple Costco trips ago, I shared with you guys a diffuser. Oh, oh, I see it over here. I think this is it. Wait, is this, is this one on clearance? No, still $40. Um, it's very, very pretty, but look, this one is a new style. Still comes with two essential oils, a eucalyptus and orange, um, but this one is $10 more. Is it worth it for the uh, price? I mean, like for the design? I don't know. Maybe you'll think so. Wait, wait, wait. An iron? Does anyone still iron? Get a steamer. You know what I mean? One of those steamer things. All right, what else? Curling wands. Oh, these hair dryers again. Let's keep walking. Okay, I feel like these go on sale pretty often. I feel like I need to up my game with my toothbrush. Those are just the heads for $40. Two pack of toothbrush, the whole toothbrush? You get two of them for 65? Yeah, there they are. Huh, huh. Huh, you guys let me know. Do you have that toothbrush? Do you love it, hate it? I feel like I need to buy it. I also feel like the toothbrush I have now cost me like four bucks, so yeah. <laughs> Here's another set. Oh my gosh, look how cute these are. These are fancy right there. Diamond clean. I feel like if you floss, oh my gosh, I love this. The black and white, wow. Very nice to look at, nice aesthetic. Oh, good golly. Uh, $200? I'm sorry, I just dropped dead. I had to get up off the floor. That is so much money. <laughs> I'm sure they're every bit worth it. Uh, I feel like if you floss the teeth that you wanna keep, uh, I think you'll be okay. But I'm not a dentist, so don't listen to me. Maybe you need to spend $200 on a toothbrush to avoid getting dentures in the future, is that? Is that how it works these days? Oh, 150. Wait, 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 wait. This one's 99. So now that $70 price, the one that's on sale, that's looking pretty good right now. All right, 
here's a blow dryer that's in my price range. Wait, okay, for a second I thought it was $100 still. No, it is 20. I feel like that's a good, that's a good price range. Well, dry your hair 50% faster. All right, people, Thanksgiving is a coming. You get this three pan set for $80. They're ceramic, they look very high quality. And then these mixing bowls, a set of three for $20. Wait, 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 are there four? There's four. Even more of a deal. Look how pretty these are too. So pretty, and they come in two colors. Mmm. I love Thanksgiving. It's my favorite holiday. What's your favorite holiday? I just love Thanksgiving. There's no pressure for gifts or anything. It's just come hang out and eat food, and that's my kind of party. <laughs> oh my gosh, they have square ones. These are really pretty too. Here's the picture on the box to give you a better idea. Ooh, oven to table. I like that. All right, guys, here's the ultimate five piece, a gadget set. Um, it's steel, which is really good quality. Don't get all that plastic stuff, you know, it's cheap, but this will last you. Wait, are these different things? No, a peeler, ice cream scoop, pizza cutter, uh, silicone spatula, and a whisk. If you break that down, that's like two, four, six, eight, ten. Nope, it's twenty dollars. So four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty. Four dollars a piece. <laughs> Okay, here, wait, 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 is that the same set again? This combo, a silicone set, which I, I like silicone because it doesn't scratch up anything I'm cooking with. So like this little, wait, it's called a slotted turner. Does anyone else call this a spatula? No, just me? Okay, a basting brush, all-purpose spatula. Oh, there it goes. I guess spatulas don't have these holes. Slotted spoon, a, ooh, a dual-ended spatula. Good for making omelets, I bet. Um, a solid spoon, these little tongs. Ooh, mini tongs? Oh, those are cute. How much is this set for 10 stinking? $20. 10 pieces for $20. Okay, go with the silicone <laughs> over the metal. <laughs> Man, are you kidding me? That's a great deal for someone who, like a housewarming gift or something. Wowza. Those colanders are really cute too. Oh my stinking, nope, look how cute this is. A serving tray, so, ooh, a picnic caddy. I'll put the dishes down there, $15. All right, these bowls are on sale again. I have the, you know what, I don't have these bowls. Mine are slightly different, but they are still very, very cute. You get six for 12 bucks. Also, these knives are still here. Normal price, $13, it's a steal. Okay, I feel like the toys are a whole new journey, a whole nother adventure. There's a peak of the prices. If you guys want me to go through the toys for you in like a separate video, in depth with prices and that kind of thing, let me know. I'm totally down, but it's not something that very interests me very much. Ooh, magic tricks, just kidding, that interests me. They're not only magic tricks, guys, they're amazing. Only 16 bucks, that is amazing. Oh my gosh, Play-Doh set, 19, Christmas gifts, already, birthday gifts, anyone else have birthdays coming up? Those dolls, $16? Okay, I'm sorry, at the Disney store, these would be like a million. Am I wrong? Shopkins, this dollhouse? Um, can I have one, please? Here I am, I'm like, um, toys don't excite me, and then I'm like drooling over it. Come on, that dollhouse, $100, and I bet you it comes with furniture. Um, heck yes it does. It's called Zoe's Dollhouse. They should not have pigeonholed it like that. I, can we just very, oh my, it has, they have hangers? Stop it. They shopped at Ikea, look at that table. So, I wanna live in that house. Okay, let's move on. Okay, I am sorry, but fingerlings are the biggest rip of a toy invention ever since, oh God, I can't even think of another toy that is less exciting. <laughs> and for the cost, it's $27. My kids both have one because they needed it. And uh, mm -mm. I don't understand the appeal. 
I know all the kids, it's all the rage, but they're not very exciting. This guy, on the other hand, I feel like I asked for that for every Christmas ever since I was like four. Never got one. Maybe I'll buy one for myself. I will keyboard, are you kidding me, $100? Come on, that's a steal. Ooh, a balance bike. What? Hold on, because that is pretty cool. There's no uh, wheels, like, you know, pedals. Look how excited she is, too. Makes me want one. <laughs> All right, these sleeping bags I showed you before, they're so cute, and they're very good quality, and humongo. Uh, those sleeping bags are $27. Pillows. Oh, my gosh, these towels. Wait, wait, wait. Are they towels or robes or both? Oh my gosh, oh, they're so cute, $14. Okay, this is definitely gonna be a standalone video. I feel like some more blankets for the children and then some gourmet goodies. Nothing beats the Fiero Rocher. I don't know how to say it, guys. I already know, I'm totally off base. But those like, you know, Nutella-based truffles. Godiva, ooh -hoo -hoo. All right, all right, all right. Crepes, biscuits with Belgian chocolate. All right, all right, what else can you have for me? What else? Belgian chocolate. I'm trying to go slowly, if I walk too fast. Ooh, ooh, a gingerbread house, $9.99. Whenever I try to make a gingerbread house, it just comes out like awful. So I have stopped trying. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. A Lego advent calendar? $23. Guys, you can't even buy a Lego set for $23. Bucks. And there's three in here, apparently. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is it just one? And they just haven't checked it out? I don't know. But here's the box. <laughs> you can decide for yourself. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 okay. So inside each little day, unbelievable. How can they sell this for $22? But at the store, each little piece is like $20. Do you feel me? Should have showed you the front of the box. There's 24 gifts. That's less than a dollar a piece. Yes, it is. <laughs> I'm great at math. Ages five to 10. Unbelievable. I don't know how I'm gonna pass this up, but I'm gonna have to, because if I get one, I'm gonna have to get one for each kid, and that's just not gonna happen. So, moving on, all media arts set. 154 pieces for that guy, and it's 29 dollars. Um, an art easel for 30 that's a little steep. If you go to Ikea, they have them for uh, I, at least half the price, I want to say. Captain Underpants, they have a ton of books, and Avelina is getting all bored of her books. She's read pretty much all of them twice. So, ooh, what's this, human body? Ooh, I really like that. World, oh, the solar system. Costco has a great... Uh, selection of books space IQ bugs robotics space and what does that say marble run oh come on engineers Academy both my kids need to go there I'm trying to show you all the books that I can those are like activity sets Oh, and then the little baby books. Oh, the floor puzzles. <gasps> I used to do a floor puzzle every night with Avelina. Maybe that's why she's so smart. <laughs> oh, a visit to Nana's, a, a book set with a stuffed animal. That's very, very cute. And then here are some book sets. My first science library, baby lit. Oh yeah. <gasps> Halloween stories is the only Halloween thing I've seen and it's legitimately like October 6th <laughs> right now. <laughs> Shouldn't there be more Halloween stuff out still? Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Ooh, Avelina is obsessed with these. She has got a strong collection going, but $8 a piece. Ugh, we get them at garage sales and secondhand. Yep, we've got that one. All right, those are all the books. I just, I get excited about the book section even though I don't really read books anymore. <laughs> true story, sad but true. Uh, anyone got a good one for me? Anyone? Book recommendations below. Okay, I'm literally, I'm just cruising around Costco with an empty cart. Uh, here, ooh, Christmas dresses. I love that purple. 
Wowza, that one looks like a good New Year's dress. Anyone else's kids party on New Year's? Cause uh, mine do. Ooh, trench coats. Okay, you can barely see anything. Let's see this dress. Fabulous. God, this one is very, very pretty. Oh, how much are these? That's that's the burning question. Oh my gosh, that white one, Snow Princess. <gasps> okay. They're $18. Oh, I love it. And I love that my kids could match. I wonder if they have any like boy. Oh, this navy one. Stop it, guys. Just stop it. Man, Costco. That's amazing. Very, very cute. All right, where are the boys at? Probably on the other side. Maybe? No? This is really cute, too. Is this women's? <laughs> Probably not. I just uh, dress like a junior. All right, I think that's it. Let's go to the food, see if we can find anything fun. Oh my gosh, I love this. They already have hams out. $1.99 a pound. I'm sure that's a fantastic price. Here it is. The cake that haunts my nightmares. Much too good for children. But that price, I can't get over how inexpensive that is for a cake. Oh, keep walking, Kim. Keep walking. Okay, Costco, I see you. This is new. $9 for two of these. It's a vegetable minestrone. And that's how big the containers are. They're huge. Ah, oh, it looks so good in the picture, don't you know? But I have to also channel Beyonce and fight my temptations with these four sticky toffee lava cakes and this mousse sea salt caramel. Are you kidding me? Okay, sorry, not sorry. I had to show you this. This is a paper plate set with napkins, small ones and big ones. I don't, the proper name is probably like dessert napkins and entree, whatever. A hundred and six. Do you see how many are in here? 160. Guess how much? Yep. You are wrong. $14. Unbelievable. It says it serves 50 people. <laughs> what? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I get it. So there's 50 plates, 50 napkins, 50 napkins. Is that the deal? Is that why it serves 50 people? But like really a little bit more than that. Okay. I got, I get you. Still a heck of a lot of plates. A ton of food you can put on there. All right, I told you guys I was good at math. I told you. <laughs> this is product marketing right here. Disney the Nutcracker. Wait, wait, is that a new movie? Have I seen that yet? I don't think so. So you get like themed bags. Come on, those are so stinking cute. And they're on sale right now for $10.69. Okay, speaking of Thanksgiving, even though I'm not, um, how many of you, where's my hand? How many of you brine your turkeys? I'm hearing this is a thing. I've never tried it before, but this turkey brine looks good enough to eat. And my goodness, you won't find a better price for cinnamon sticks, $5.89 for this honkin' thing. Are you, I don't even know what I'm gonna do with these, but I'm getting them. <laughs> okay, I am torn right now. So I want to buy these, they're whole wheat tortillas. There's 20 of them. These are $5.79. But the alternative is getting the normal flour ones there are two 18 count, and those are four bucks. They're cheaper, and you get almost double. Ugh, health over cost, I tell you. Like, how much more expensive is it really to use whole wheat flour? You know? Well, I guess this is really a thing. Matcha butter cookies. <laughs> People love matcha, that matcha? I don't, I'm not a fan. These are going really quickly. They are $13. Oh, actually, you know what? They're fully stocked over here. Up front, uh, they're going quickly, but they're so stinking cute. They come with two pairs, a single pair, and then one with the animal face. Oh my, how can you resist me? Take me home. I am intrigued by these. I've heard everyone talk about how apple cider vinegar is the cure-all. Guys, let me know if you've tried these because I've tried drinking apple cider vinegar and it makes me want to vomit. $18 is a little steep. Let me know if you've tried them, if you've seen, I don't know, any kind of benefit. Okay guys, found the ultimate gift for all 10 of your girlfriends that you have. 
um, including me. Get me something. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, how many are in here? Two, four, six, eight. Ooh, ten. It's perfect. You can match it with... Oh, okay. Eight masks and two bonus exfoliating pads. You can match it with the perfume we found out front. Boom. Girlfriend gift. Those are on sale right now. $11.99. Milk, honey, pearl, charcoal, aloe, uh, aqua, <laughs> collagen, and milk feet. What does that say? Milk feel. I can read. Ah, I scanned over what kind they are, but this tells you what they're good for. Okay, oh my gosh, I want these. <laughs> I'm dying. A little girl just brought these to her mom and said, I want that. And she said, okay, put them in the cart. Oh, I wish I was that mom. Yep, like, yeah, go ahead. But I'm like trying to talk myself out of it. Dark chocolate covered, or oh, I was gonna say raisins. <laughs> Raspberries, <gasps> because that sounds more appealing. Guys, they're $10. Like I should just do it, right? I haven't seen the chocolate covered coconut balls in a long time. The almond ones, you know? Okay. Oh, the internal fight, the struggle I have with myself. Let's just, let's just hold on to them. Put these in the maybe pile. <laughs> okay, remember my last shop with me where I showed you these succulents and I looked like a total idiot? Because I said, oh, they're fake, oh yeah. Uh, no, they're real and they are $22. Steel. Also, I'm gonna abandon my cart for a second and show you these. I almost didn't, but then I thought, ugh, I have to. Almond butter chocolate granola bites? Come on. $13 for 30 count. And there's the sugar content. Oh, not too bad, 10 for how many? Ooh, four bites. Not too bad, not too bad. All right, holy cow, it's hot outside. That concludes the shop with me. Um, I got five hot dogs on the way out and five sauerkraut and a drink. It was a mess because I didn't have a car. I was just holding it in my hands because I went back into the store to get them. I dropped them. It was an ordeal, guys, okay? But they're safely in my car right now uh, to bring home to our family and guests. So, thank you for hanging out with me, and I hope I showed you some fun things during the shop with me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.